So I've been growing out my hair for the last five months or so and today I'm ready to fully bleach my hair. So I went ahead and I got two boxes of the Revlon Color Effects Platinum and it's supposed to be a high lifting kit so we'll see up to eight shades. So there's the shades. Um, my roots obviously you can see them they are very long. It's been five months okay no grays I always check for grays turn around no grays <laughs> I'm always checking I found one like back here like couple months ago and I don't know what happened to it I hope I didn't pull it out by accident because you're not supposed to you don't pull out your grays don't pluck them that's the worst thing you could do so today we are gonna take care of these ugly roots and uh, bleach the whole way I'm gonna you know since my my roots are around that color so they should be around like that the rest of the hair since it has hair dye in it should be around you know the platinum color we'll see i'm gonna leave it in longer in the roots and then comb it through and then leave it in the rest of the hair about 10 minutes the roots at least 30 so we'll see because they're really dark this is really dark and then i'm also growing out my eyebrows you could see from the filter but you could see i have a filter on of course because i have no makeup on you could see my eyebrows they're also growing out so i want to grow them out as pushy as possible so now let's get this um oh and i'm also going to bleach my extension which is human hair i have kinky natural waves and thick hair so there's not a lot of extensions that fit my hair this is i think this one was called brazilian like kinky wave or something and it's short it's only like 18 inches long I just you know right now my hair is short obviously because I've been cutting it from all the damage so this matches my natural kind of my natural hair a little bit but I'm gonna bleach her as well I think I'm gonna ombre her out so I'm gonna leave the dark root look and then probably up to right there and then I'm gonna bleach the rest down here so I'm gonna leave dark roots so I, I am gonna grow out my roots again after this for indefinite time because i do want the ombre look eventually and i'm gonna enjoy my natural roots i'm gonna let my natural roots grow out again with the bleach and then kind of rock the ombre look for a while let's see how it goes but let's get started mm -hmm. okay so what do we get in our kit we get our color developer we get the um bleach powder and you get the little protection or protective oil for your hair so you're going to mix these three together and then that's going to become the hair dye. It also comes with a shampooing, it's like a purple shampoo, I believe, and like a little kind of toning conditioner. I do need a toner after this, obviously. I'm going to get a toner. So let's see how it all mixes out. Okay, so I have my hair parted. I think I'm going to start and everything's mixed. So I think I'm going to start from the back. I usually that's where I start. That is the darkest part of my hair is the back roots. So we're going to start right here.
temperature. Okay, so I did my majority of the back already. I'm gonna let down more hair to get higher. That is what the back is looking like. Okay, so I'm not going all the way down yet. Not yet, just the roots, just the dark hair. All right, so now we let, we're going in with this piece. I want to get over here by the ears because I always miss spots over here. Like that. Sideburns because we don't want dark hairs sticking out with our bleach hair. Okay. Get all those edges, all that hairline first, and then move in. All right, let's come over here. Same thing. Behind the ear. Make sure you go behind the ear, rub it in. All into your roots. Sideburns. This stuff doesn't, I mean, it burns, but it doesn't, you know unimaginable burn because I'm just so used to messing with my hair and doing my own hair dyes all the time so it's not I'm not tripping on it all right so I'm gonna do the rest of the back of the roots and then I'll come and do the front okay so I got all of the top done just rubbing it in getting it all in there you see the roots no more dark roots, getting light. So we're leaving the ends alone for now, for a few more minutes. Okay, nothing on the ends yet because there's a lot of bleach there already. We don't want to like kill the whole hair. Right now we're focusing on these dark roots. I think I'm gonna have to do a part two. And I didn't want to tap into the second bottle on my hair, but I'm gonna run out of this. So I'm gonna have to use two bottles on this head. Hopefully I have enough left for my extension, which I don't know if I'm going to have enough bleach. <laughs> I'm hoping, I'm hoping that we have enough bleach for our extension. All right, let's finish it up. So push stop, sun, my very handy sun. Okay, so I have my head all wrapped in my shopping bag. Just a few more minutes, uh, the easy part's over. Just let it burn now for a few more minutes and then we wash it out. I'm gonna bleach my eyebrows because as you can see, they are very dark. And then I'm gonna match my new hair. So for that. Just go right over the eyebrow. I get a little bit on my finger, it's hard with the gloves. But I get a little bit on my finger, like that, and then just come right over the brow. Don't get it in your eye, only on the brow, okay? Blonde eyebrows. We shall have them. We shall have the blonde brow. <laughs> I don't know how that's going to look with my dark lashes, but... Vale madre ya. Quiero ser güera. We want to be blonde. All right. And we are ready to give it a few more minutes. I'm going to start working on my extensions. And then we'll see what happens. I'm going to have to do a part two. And we'll see the new hair at home bleach job. So here's the hair. It's already fully dried. I like it. It's a little bit yellow, but I can tone it later on. Hopefully I didn't miss any spots. Get some more video tomorrow in the sunlight. 